So everybody knows the new M2 is out. Uh, there is a new Blender version out 3.2. There is a new Blender bench that uses that new Blender version. So I've decided to compare my trusty Intel i9 uh, 2.4 gigahertz uh, MacBook Pro with the new M2 processor, which already has the Blender benchmarks out. After a quick warm up, uh, Blender did uh, 392 points with my built in Radeon Pro 5500, which is quite respectable for a 2019 machine. The Vega 56, which is much more powerful, did uh, 615 points. And when we look at the database, the M2 does 280 points, which is much less than my built in Radeon Pro. To quickly summarize what happened, uh, the Vega did 615 points and that's going to be our 100% benchmark. Then the Radeon Pro, the built-in into the laptop, did 392 points or 57% slower than the Vega 56. And the M2, expectedly, did 220% uh, slower, 2.2 times slower than the Vega 56. What the numbers tell us is that M2 is not really up to speed even with my 2019 machine using a much more powerful GPU. M2 is a low-end laptop. If you need more performance, you need the M1 Max or M1 Ultra. I would definitely skip the M1 Pro also.